Hello and welcome to part two of our special homecoming episode. If you haven't seen part one yet, go and check that out before watching this one. You can find it on our Facebook page or on YouTube. Yeah, and now we got a lot of great highlights from the wins of girls soccer, field hockey, and volleyball. So go check out the highlights. Girls Varsity Soccer took on Hackley on main field during homecoming 2017. Here's their first goal off a corner kick. The Lions have played very well all season and are in a top spot challenging for Ivies. The Lions try to utilize their speed and their ability to switch the field as, as they have been all season. My school next sprinting down the right sideline putting a ball into the middle. Unfortunately no one was there for the Lions. But we see here again down the right flank the ball is driven and it finds its way to Maya Skolnick again. She's able to cut inside, put a ball far post. What a goal for HM. A breakaway for the Lions in this play, but Hackley's goalkeeper is able to come out, clear the ball for a throw-in. Hackley on the ball now, pressuring the defense, trying to work something at the other end. Cutting through the defenders, the Hackley player, with the shot, goal for Hackley. It was a very tight game indeed. Jane Frankel in her traditional orange goalkeeper uniform, able to clear the ball there. And here you can see one of the reasons for the Lions' success this year. They're passing. They're able to find the open player, switch the field, move the ball, and without too many touches, they're able to spring forth attacks. And at the end of these plays, they're able to put in crosses, although this one would go straight to the goalkeeper. And in the next play, Sophia Ficka finds the ball, one of the star players this year. And you can see the triangles that HM makes. Maya Skolnick, Beatrix Bondor, Sophia Ficka. And this is just another factor in their strong ability to pass the ball. And the Lions would go on to beat Hackley at homecoming. In a very close game with a score of 4-3. Improving their record and taking them one step closer to attaining their Ivy League dream. Hashtag beat Hack. That was the mantra and goal of the HM Varsity Field Hockey Team. And this homecoming, they did just that. Hackley drew a foul in the circle with no time on the clock in overtime, so the corner had to be played out. Hackley's last chance to tie the game, and as you can see right here with the incredible defense of the Lions, the shot was blocked and helped give HM the victory they wanted. Pure joy on the faces of every player, every coach, and every fan after a riveting game. The final score of the game was 2-1, to one, and we're going to watch right here exactly how that happened. Horace Mann with the first goal of the game, a pass from Devin Kleiner to Ariana Lawfer in the circle. Ariana takes a nice reverse shot that goes right into the goal, and Horace Mann is up on the board. Hackley responded a little bit later on with a corner shot that went in, but Horace Mann kept on fighting. Horace Mann defense was truly critical to the victory. You can see right here, they keep the ball out of the circle, even though the ball was right in front of the goal. Anya Swift's going to take it up a bit, and she's going to have an impeccable pass through the legs of the Hackman defender off to Arna Lawson. So anyone who says field hockey is boring to watch, you did not see this game because it was incredible to see every single Horace Mann player fight so hard to get this win. We've got Katie Goldenberg who's working tirelessly to get through the defense. She's going to have a major hit. Off to Sophie Koss who had an amazing game. She's going to have a reverse shot right here in the circle to bring the score to 2-1 to one. in overtime. Horace Mann takes the lead. Sophie Koss was unbeatable this game with her speed and her attack. And I wish I had time to speak with every single player. We've got this player right here with an amazing stop to prevent a goal. There is not one single Horace Mann player who doesn't deserve recognition. Sarah Swolnick with some jaw-dropping action on offense. Welcome to Jess some amazing hits on defense. Gigi Lee coming out on top with an incredible tackle after a hack of the player decides to break free. The list goes on to every player, JV Varsity, that brought Horace Mann to this historic win. Nice days, 2.30, Wednesday, home game, be there. And with that OT win, that was the first time in 11 years that Horseman beat Hackley in field hockey. Yeah, that was a great game. Uh, and you should definitely go check out the rest of field hockey's games for the rest of the season. And we have volleyball coming at you right now from the main gym. And as you can tell by all the posters in the background, it's homecoming. And the Lions are looking to pick up a win. And right away, the Lions get a point with a nice set over the net by Brittany Jones. So Horseman serving now, going against Grace Church, and after three touches on the opponent's side, they're going to spike it over. The libero for this game, Annie Yarsh, is going to try to bump it, but it goes into the basketball hoop. Unfortunately, not two points for the Lions, but they're here serving again. 
and after a run from Grace Church, Morgan Joseph is going to use her height to her advantage and tap the ball over for a horseman point. But horseman going to serve again, and Morgan Joseph again, with great recognition of where the ball was, unfortunately, that's going to be out of bounds. This point is going to be a great rally with great hustle from both sides, and so we'll get a chance to talk about the season for volleyball so far. They come into this game at 3-8, and eight, but all three of those wins coming in the last five games, so Horseman has been in a hot streak of late. So the Lions in this game trying to make it four out of the last six that they have won to come back from an 0-6 start to the season. And again, here great hustle from Morgan Joseph, however that would bounce on Horseman's side and would be a point to Grace Church. Horseman dominated pretty much the whole game with a rare point to Grace Church right there. They've been showing great teamwork of late and would go on to win this game three sets to zero, impressing their home fans at homecoming. And just for good measure, Brittany Jones with a spike right here. Thanks for watching this special two-part homecoming episode. We'll see you next time.